Okay, welcome to my brand new series. This is the Android Tablet Applications Episode 1. And in this series, we're just going to be taking a look at Android applications that are specifically designed for the tablet. I may review applications that I've done before. That's only to see how the application itself um, uses up the whole screen. Um, you know how it is. I'm just going to be taking a look at a couple Android applications and then looking at a wall live wallpaper at the end. Um, this won't be a weekly thing. I'll try to get it out every week, but I can't guarantee that. Anyway, let's get this thing started. Okay, the first application we're gonna take on a look at body. Um, this is uh, made by Google. This is if you wanna like learn more about the human body, like for example, all the different organs, the muscles, um, the bones and everything. This is perfect. Um, at the top, we've got the uh, search bar. We've got all of these little icons here. Could use more touch you have the whole human body there um if you go to here it shows you all the uh, different muscles that are in your body you got the bones you got like uh, all the different um organs and the internal parts you got all the muscles and this is the brain and what the brain is connected to if you want to learn more about this or you're studying this in college or university or you're a doctor or anything like that this is a perfect application or if you just want to know more about the human body and how it works um, you can get this application free from the android marketplace okay so the next application we'll be taking a look at is file manager hd um as you know like uh, android uh, devices don't normally come with like a file manager installed like to access the uh, content on your sd card or in the internal storage um, this application is great for doing that it's right here displays all the um, folders and items that are in your um, internal memory or SD card um, say for example you want to open one let's go into download you could access the application it opens up the gallery straight away or you could edit it if you just long press it you can see the details of it you could open it up you could edit it and in the edit you could copy um, it or move it around in the internal storage or delete or rename it this is really a fully featured uh, file manager that you can get there's still a bunch more features um, if you want to view it like in a grid, you could view it in a grid and there's just a bunch of different options that you could do and refresh and install applications a lot of stuff that you could do with this uh, file manager and you could access all your content from here as well um, you could get this free from the Android marketplace okay so the next application we take a look at is movies um, you could get this from the marketplace um, this is where you will come to look for all the latest movies all the movies that are about to be released um, right here the interface is nice, it uses up the whole screen you got the different categories at the top, box office, cinemas, upcoming, DVD and my movies and right here it has all the latest uh, movies that are going to be released in the cinema or that are released already and you say if you want to and say for example you wanted to open one up, you just tap into it, you can play the trailer it shows you all the information you need to know about the movies, the stars that are um, playing in the movie, the critic reviews, user reviews it's really good and if you go over to cinemas it searches for the nearest cinemas um, by your location so you could say for example you wanted to go see this movie in the cinema you could easily just find your nearest cinema and just call them up book it and they've got the address and everything there you can have upcoming this is like the coming soon section so all the movies that are going to be coming soon if you're just interested in finding out like what new movies are going to be coming soon this is great you also have dvds same goes for dvds as well so if you example you just want to know what the latest DVDs are that are being released or that are coming soon um, This is the application, it's very simple, I like how it uses up the entire screen And you can get this free from the Android Marketplace Next application we'll be taking a look at is Plume uh, This is a Twitter application uh, This is probably one of my favourite uh, Twitter applications I'll use this on my uh, Galaxy S2 and it's just perfect um, They've optimised this for the tablet So you have your three different categories you have your timeline, your mentions and your direct messages but I got rid of direct uh, messages here and put um, a timeline here just for the video um, you can scroll across through all of these uh, different time um, your timelines you, if you want to make a new tweet you just tap at the top and you just type whatever you want you could also attach different um, photos from your gallery or just take a picture and upload it straight to your Twitter you could just mention people there as well so just, you could just send that like that and you should see it appear right there you could also search search through um, trends as well which is really good 
you can see you got your settings and everything you can add multiple accounts um, this is really good um, Twitter application I've been using this for well over a year now and it's just the best it just um, does the job really well and you could go check it out it's free from the um, Android marketplace so the next application we take a look at is Plasma Sound. Um, this is an application where you could kind of make your own notes or frequencies. Like for example, if you put your finger down, you could hear the kind of note. The higher, when you go to the right side of the screen, the higher it is. And when you go to the left side of the screen, the lower it is. You could just move around and just make different sounds and stuff. You could use more than one fingers to, you know, make a really good sound. And there's a bunch of different effects you could add. You could adjust the volume, the delay. You could add in instruments in there as well, which is really good. And it's just a really good application and you could get this free from the Android Marketplace. The last application we take a look at is tablet wallpapers. These are um, wallpapers that are specifically designed for tablets. Um, they've got a bunch of different categories at the side you could choose from. Say for example, you wanted Android. This is the first one. It comes up with a bunch of different pictures. Uh, say for example you wanted this one you can just do set as wallpaper and if you go back to the home screen you can get it set sometimes it doesn't uh, fit the screen properly but it's still very good um, if you go from it back up you got a different one you got animals let's try you you can see there's just a bunch of different uh, wallpapers that you could choose from the one I'm currently using is this one but there's just a bunch of different um, categories that you could choose from and the wallpapers are really good and high quality and you can get this through from the Android marketplace and the last thing we're going to be taking a look at is a live wallpaper um, we're just going to get this loaded up it's not a live wallpaper the live wallpaper we're going to be taking a look at is stars you can see let's get this loaded up it fills up the whole screen and as you tap, the stars kind of move away from where your finger is. It's just a really nice uh, live wallpaper to have and try out. And you can get this through from the Android Marketplace. Um, that's about it for the review. Tell me what you think. Leave your comments below. Um, recommend me some tablet applications to review. Um, tab tablet applications that are specifically designed for the Android tablet. And that's about it. Follow me on Google Plus and Twitter. And thanks for watching. Welcome to my brand new series, this is the Android Tablet Applications Episode 1 and in this series we're going to be taking a look at Android applications that are spe 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 <laughs>